Hey, Rusty here, and welcome to this series on game creation using your phone. Today you will learn how to create a player object, add user interaction, and set up the game physics in Pocket Code Game Engine. Let's create a new game and set its orientation to portrait. Now let's add your player object. Press the orange X, go to Media Library, and choose an object here. I like the hot air balloon, and here we can place it visually. As you can see, this balloon is kind of big, so we're going to need to resize it. Click on your balloon. Go into here, add a look, and choose set size as. We're going to change this to 40%. We want the player to randomly spawn. Click on the place at X field, choose edit formula, select function, and then random. Add the values to spawn between. Now we need to set the player object motion type so both gravity and interactions with other objects will occur. Click motions, set motion type, gravity with bounce. Now the fun part of player controls. Under events, choose when tapped. Move it to the very bottom. Now anytime the balloon is tapped, it will run the following code. Let's add a motion of set velocity so the balloon will go up. We want the x value to stay the same, so press properties and set it to x velocity. Change the y value to 250. Now we need to add some game physics of gravity. So add a motion, then set gravity, and let's set it to negative 25. But with this, the player can still go off the screen. So under motions, let's turn on the boundary bounce interactions. By adding a control forever loop around this, it'll make sure that the player is constantly not touching the boundary. All right, let's press play and check out our creation. Hey guys, you made a very simple game here. On the next one, we're going to add some more objects and some animations. Hope you enjoy.